what we're doing right now is uh, this is a brand new worn axon winch and it's a wire rope so we're gonna stretch the cable before you use your winch for the first time ever you want to make sure you stretch the cable because when they wrap it on the spool at the factory it's not stretched it's just loosely put on there so when you go to winch for the first time if you don't stretch it you're gonna pull that top layer down through the bottom layers and you're actually gonna kink it and you're gonna put um, burrs in it and you're gonna ruin your cable want to make sure you stretch your winch cable first time no matter whether it's wire rope or synthetic rope save yourself a lot of trouble in the long run y'all know uh, we've been talking on live talk about uh, draw on your machine the more you put on it the more it's going to draw and then your battery can't keep up you have to run a dual battery setup well a uh, perfect example we were talking about was a winch how much the winch uses and how much it draws from your machine when you use it so we can see right here we're at 14.2 volts and we're just idling. See how it's going down just by winching? That's your, that's your draw on your battery. You don't want to run it so long that you have nothing left in your battery. But you can see just by winching a little bit, you can see the bolts just dropping. So there you go, make sure when you're winching, you stop, let your charging system come back up, give your winch motor a chance to cool down. You don't want to keep going, 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 it's like a starter. You overheat it and you'll do damage to it. 